This week on Gaming News, we talk about Injustice, Gods Among Us, and some of the playable characters that have been added to the game. We also talk about a big SimCity news update coming in 2013 for the SimCity franchise. This is Wicked Gamer HD reporting for Gaming News, and our first story is about Injustice, God Among Men where some of the best DC characters, the people know, have been brought to a new 2D brawler by Netherrealm. They've just added a new character to the roster, which is Catwoman, so lock up your windows and doors and hide the cover as the most notorious cat burglar in history hits your computer game consoles in 2013. I've uh, created a little video for you to watch so you can have a preview of it, but the full Catwoman trailer is available to find on the internet anywhere you go, for example YouTube and computerandvideogame.com. Plus other people will be doing stories on this so you're bound to find it somewhere, but this will be one game I will be getting my claws into. <laughs> Remember the good old days back in the 90s, building your own cities, sending your people off to work? Well, good news for Mac users. SimCity is finally coming to the Mac. You can get rid of all your boring dragon games and all your little point to click games because you'll be able to build virtual cities. The SimCity is due to get released on the Mac uh, in February 2013. This is going to be running alongside the PC version, but it's not a remake. This is a fully version of a new remake of SimCity. Black Ops 2. Come on, Black Ops 2. What more can I say about Black Ops 2? People have done thousands and thousands and thousands of videos of Black Ops 2, but here's something you didn't know. Got leaked today. 50 minute gameplay of multiplayer. Of the developers actually playing a multiplayer game. So you can actually see the graphics, the gameplay of the multiplayer while they are actually playing the game. Also, officially announced are the new kill streaks, which are not going to be kill streaks, they are going by the MW3 system and they're going to be using score streaks. But so far, Black Ops 2 is looking good. That's if it does actually really reach the shelves, since there is a court battle going on at the moment in America because Treyarch have broke their original contract by basing the game into the future. We will keep you more updated with that story as we get it in ourselves but this has been wicked gamer hd with the first episode of gaming news for the mystery gamers network i hope <laughs>